So it is day two of the Love Fuck Challenge. Today is July the 12th. The only thing that I've had this morning is my apple cider vinegar with cayenne pepper and lemon juice. Of course, drink that first thing in the morning. Um, I have had um, just about done, I'll show you here, with my lemon water. Um, usually it's 32 ounces that I drink. And I am now getting ready to take my liver focus for the morning. It's 10 o'clock. Yesterday, I took it about 10 o'clock as well. I'm opting not to take it with a um, meal only because I fast. And I don't eat breakfast. And I don't usually eat, start to eat food until 12 p.m. anyway. So, so far, I haven't had any side effects to taking the liver focus. Um none still drinking my water plenty of it at least a gallon excuse my little shawl y'all i'm in my office and i'm cold natured so it is what it is <laughs> um but i'm gonna go ahead on and i'm gonna go ahead and take my two capsules for the day that way um you can see that i'm taking them it's not a joke this is what they look like this is on. Look like it's turmeric in it, which I know turmeric is for sure in it. I'll just show you a close up of the bottle so you can see. Mm. And of course, I'm halfway finished with my first 32 ounce of water. And that'll be it. So, um, I am going to try and document this entire journey um, just to see what the results are and see how they, you know, pan out for me. And if this is going to be something that I'll probably continue uh, using uh, just to stay healthy. Because, again, that's what the purpose of this challenge is for, for me. Better me, healthier me. Um, that's it. Um, I am, I probably will try and add some smoothies in here and there. Um, JJ Smith has a group that I'm a part of that I've been looking and trying to check out some of them and I'll probably end up adding smoothies to them. But for the most part, I just want you to kind of see what I'm eating, how I'm eating, when I'm eating throughout this journey. So you can get a feel for, you know, what worked for me and the results that I end up getting. So at lunchtime today, um, I'll probably come back and just record or snap a picture or something of what I'm going to be eating for lunch today. Um, and then I'll come back again this evening and journal, you know, my workout for this evening and what all I have planned for this evening and what I get done. I'm going to try and do this every day. I'm going to commit to trying to document every single day. It might not be every meal or anything like that but i'm going to try and document some pieces of what i'm doing and what i'm eating of course what i'm drinking you already know that's not going to change unless i add a smoothie so you guys will see what i did throughout this process one of the benefits to taking the liver focus was you know better skin um hair growth um it's a lot of pros to taking the liver focus so i am doing the whole no makeup <laughs> challenge as well while i am you know taking this because i just want to see you know full results of you know the after effects of my skin so i have beauty marks you know what they call beauty marks moles they are hereditary so i have them all over my face my neck you know they started to come out after I had kids, and I'm okay with that. But for the most part, my skin, you know, has been relatively good. I don't have any issues with it, but I just want to see if it gives me a better glow or, you know, how it helps it out. Um, I want to see how, you know, the growth of my nails. Um, of course, I'm natural. I got braids in now, so you can't see, but I'm sure throughout this challenge before, it's over where you'll see what the natural state of my hair is. Okay, so I know I said that I would come back on and kind of show you what I'm having for lunch today. Today I'm having uh, some roasted potato wedges 
with garlic and Parmesan cheese and just a little sour cream. I'm not doing any vegetables for lunch because for dinner, all I'm going to have is my cucumbers. Just cucumbers, paprika with very light Italian dressing. That's going to be my dinner for this evening. So let me just give you a quick peek. See? So I am trying to hurry up and eat my dinner while also cooking something really simple and quick for the kids and for the hubby. Cucumbers. And what I'm having for dinner when I'm cooking my family some really quick and easy um, turkey and cheese sliders. Cause I don't have time to really do too much of anything else and I need to go and get my work out in before it gets too late. I'm running late from work today, so I just want to tap in so you can see exactly what I'm eating. I won't eat this whole bowl. I just had to cut up a, a cucumber and it was very huge. So I'll end up saving the rest of these and I'll probably have these for lunch tomorrow or snack tomorrow. Um, I didn't have anything for snack today. Well, yes, I did. I take that back. I had one hard boiled egg as a snack this afternoon. Um, I'm already on my fourth glass of water. 32 ounce glass of water. I'm not going to drink any of this right now. So I'll fill that back up when I come back from working out and drink another one before bedtime. I won't drink it now because if I do it now, I have to go to the restroom way too many times between now and the time of my, um, workout is over with so so um really quick i did want to jump on before i stop my jog to say that i noticed today that my urine is crystal clear when i say crystal clear i mean crystal clear and usually you know use the restroom see your urine in the toilet when you get up to get ready to flush the toilet and this you know, yellow, not too dark, not too light, but enough the way you can tell is urine. Baby, when I say I couldn't see and it looked like a toilet bowl of water, that's how clear it was. I don't think it's a bad thing. I really just think it's just my liver just, you know, detoxing itself. So we'll see. I'll continue to monitor it and see what comes of it. But I don't think it's a bad thing you know we'll just see but so far that's the only thing i've noticed okay so i have come back from my workout and i want to just kind of show you guys something of course the waist train and i don't know if you can see this or not but just look at the amount of sweat that I have from this workout like oh you really can't see it that good but like my leggings are so I have sweat everywhere um but I guess that's what the liver focus is supposed to be doing it's supposed to be helping you burn the fat uh if you can see here just to get a idea of what I'm working with. This is my problem area. This is what I'm wanting to get rid of. Some might not think it's that bad, but for me, I do. Like I said before, I don't have much back fat, but this love handles, as you can see from the front view, I am soaking wet. Side view, you know, that's what I'm, this belly fat is what I'm trying to get rid of. A little fupa area where, like, right down here, as you can see, that is just, I don't know. It's just too much for me. Yeah, I want to get rid of it. So, hopefully, within the next 30 days, that's what we're going to tackle. But I just wanted to show you guys how much I sweat today using my waistband and I use the wet waist waistband which makes you sweat anyway but I have never sweat as much as I sweated today using the waistband 
these light, they're so, they're too light. You really can't see how wet, like these are so, like soaking wet all over from my butt all the way over to my stomach. It's just too wet. But anyway, I want to shower. I'm going to get ready for bed because one of the things that I do want to do is make sure that I'm getting them sleep. I'm a night owl. I usually don't get to bed till 11, 12 o'clock, but I do want to start getting in the bed by 10 p.m. each night so that I can get adequate enough rest while I am doing this challenge because they did state that rest is a key factor to it. So I just want to kind of add a few more hours to my sleep patterns while I'm doing this challenge and see how it goes from there. But that's it for tonight. Got another glass of water that I need to drink. 32 ounces that I need to drink. It's right here. About to get to it. And then I'll do my apple cider vinegar. And hopefully be in the bed after this good old hot shower. Within the next hour and a half or so. <laughs>